This is America. We have the founding fathers that wrote the Constitution that we haven't lived by in 142 years. Hello, everybody. How y'all doing? Hope everybody's doing fine. I really do. You know, yesterday, I made a video. We talked about all kinds of things. We did. And today, in the background here, you're going to see a video playing. You're not going to hear it. You're going to have to go to the link in the below section. It's up in two places. Daily Motion and Zeekly. But this is a video that RT put up. And miraculously, it got taken down. You know, yesterday I was talking about Alex Jones. Not that I agree with everything he says. And I give you a scenario why he might do certain things. Not protecting or not defending. Just giving you an accusation to let you think about. Mainly because, you know, <clears throat> all of you know that there is something to all of this. Everything that we do, everything that he does, there's truth in everything that everybody does. Uh, now, I say there's truth in everything that everybody says, it, for exceptions in certain few. This, that's for another video, and we're not talking about that. We're mainly talking about the RT video. <clears throat> talking about Obama, Bush, and Cheney being arrested, scared to go out of the United States. They're prisoners in their own home. Now, folks, why would that be? Why would Bush and Cheney have that scenario against them? Does that have anything to do with... War crimes. Hmm. I'm betting you war crimes for a crime that was committed or supposedly committed by another country that was it committed by another country or was it committed with inside help. And that's straight up. I'm being serious. Now, you can call it conspiracy theory, you can call it anything you want. I really don't care. But this is a news agency put out of it, put out something. It wasn't up very long and got taken down. Now, to hear the audio, you're going to have to go to these other pages before it gets taken down. And before everyone else uploads it to as many places that you can. Now, if you got a backup channel, whatever the case may be, by all means, upload it, reload it everywhere you can. Because if RT took it down, there was a reason why they took it down. Why they, did they take it down? Don't know. Were they made to take it down? I'm betting your sweet ass it is. With no doubt. 9-11 was, hey, was it real? Yes. Did it happen the way they said it happened? Hell no. It did not. It didn't happen the way they said it happened. Under no circumstance. Y'all all know that. <clears throat> you know all of that anymore. There's no if, ands, or buts about it. You know as well as I do. 
even the newcomers, even the people that are just waking up, knows that 9-11 is an inside job. You know that diesel fuel, kerosene, and jet fuel is all the same fuel. And neither of the three burn any hotter than the other. And that is not hot enough to melt or weaken two inch six by six steel beams. There's no way. And some of it was even four inches thick. And to cut that with a torch, it had been there forever. They did it with great big old torches. Great big old semi-tractor trailers with hydrogen and oxygen hoses hooked up to them so they could have plenty of flow. I bet you it took a bunch of truckloads. Unless they got some other kind of machine like a plasma arc or plasma beam or they might even found a laser beam that could get in there in them areas to do that. But those beams under no circumstances melted with jet fuel. There's no way. And every war since a 9-11, every war since, and everything that's happened since is to take your rights, my rights, your children's rights, your grandchildren's rights away from them from now on for life. <laughs> is that what you want for your family? Is that what you want for your children? Is that what you want for your grandchildren? Uh, that's just straight up. All you yai-yais and hoo-hoos and the wah-wahs and playing your little games, go right ahead. Go right ahead. Because the more you play, the more you pay. Now that's just straight up. You keep playing, the more you pay. And all the rest of us have to pay because of your stupidity. Now that's just straight up. You don't like it. I can't help it. I didn't make the rules. I didn't make these rules. I didn't make them at all. Life and society has made these rules. You don't like them, then do something about them. Quit screwing with the small man and go after the corporate entity that is destroying your life. And that's just straight up. I hope that answered a lot of questions for y'all. If it didn't, Maybe you need to look in the mirror and examine yourself. Make sure that you're really who you think you are. Because I'm going to find, I have already found, that there's quite a few out there that aren't what they say they are. And they aren't who they make you think they are either. And that's just straight up too. If you didn't like it, I can't help it. I can't help it. Facts are facts. Truth is truth. A lie is a damn lie. And that's just straight up. If you're going to give lies, you're going to get lies. You're going to let it in your ears. You hear it. It's a lie. If you're watching TV, it's a lie. It's just like watching a movie. You get... You get more truth from TV movies anymore than you do from your mainstream media news. And that's a fact. Is RT line their mainstream? Ah, hell, I don't know. I don't know at all. Why would they put up something that was a lie like this? Hmm. Is that why they had to take it down? Because it was the truth? There you go. Don't know. It's all up to you folks, folks. It is all up to all of us to make our responses and do our duty of being free, loving, individual Americans and sovereign 
not sovereign citizens because there's no such thing. You can't be a sovereign and a citizen at the same time. That's a fact. So all of this bullshit you keep hearing about sovereign citizens, they're coming after sovereigns, that's all bullshit. It's all a lie. All a lie. Because there's no such thing. There's no such thing. Get it through your damn heads. There's no such thing. You can't be both. You can only be one. You don't want to be a citizen. You want to be sovereign. You want to be a free individual. And that's straight up. Sorry about the bird. But hey, there you go. Life is life. So with that, folks, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you don't, you didn't like it, you don't want to be free, for God's sakes, look in the mirror. From my cold, dead hands, abolish corporate government for your freedoms. Much love to y'all. Y'all all have a great day now, and a damn well mean it. Let's do something before it's too late. We're losing this battle of freedom. Abolish corporate government for you freedom folks. Much love. Don't forget to follow Tattoo1009.com on Facebook and Twitter and YouTube and damn the motion and stumble upon. Please help spread the word by sharing our articles on your favorite social networks. Go to the links in the below section for updates every day. From my cold dead hands abolish the corporate government.